The overall goal of this experiment is to evaluate the fatigue life of material in the ultra-high cycle region. This method can help answer key questions about safety and reliability of metallic components, which have to withstand over 10 million loading cycles during operation. This technique is based on driving the specimen into the longitudinal vibration at its 20 kHz resonance frequency, which means that approximately 20,000 loading cycles are carried out in a second. To be able to drive the specimen into vibration at a particular resonance frequency, its size and shape must be carefully designed for the resonance condition. The tests will be conducted with an ultrasonic fatigue testing device. Specimens of the experimental material must be machined to have the standard hourglass geometry for tension compression tests. This drawing of the test specimen labels the relevant dimensions. Choose the head diameter, the gauge diameter, and the gauge radius according to material parameters and test conditions. These determine the gauge length. The head length defines the total mass of the specimen and must be calculated to fulfill the resonance condition at 20 kHz. Begin by preparing the testing device. Select an appropriate sonotrode for the required displacement range. Screw the connection screw into the sonotrode until it reaches the bottom. Then spread a small amount of acoustic gel on the sonotrode's face. Next, screw the sonotrode into the piezoelectric converter. Move to the computer for the ultrasonic system. Use the control software to find the actual resonance frequency of the system.